to to what's been going on in that we've been reading about um, concerning the ECR plant. This has been going on for a while, and there were a number of employees um, who wished to remain anonymous um, that had contacted me. Inside the city of West Palm, there are very few avenues that the commission does have, and it has to rise to a level that is separate from what is the functions of the mayor, and that is the administrative personnel issues. But it became, it came to a place where uh, there were, um, at least to my knowledge, accusations that that um, equipment or other things were leaving. Uh, the plant, and I believe that it rose to a level that needed to go to our internal auditor, and he agreed. Um, and in the process of doing that and looking into it, which is the reason he was over there to begin with, um, not I didn't direct him what to do. I, I suggested that he look into it. He agreed that it was something of concern. Um, while he was over there, he was called back, not by the commission, not by any of us, um, and that I had a big concern with. Um, so I had asked and, and sent, because we don't necessarily have a um, more of an emergency process, um, our typical process would be to have a conversation at the next audit committee meeting or mayor commission workshop, I believe that this rose to a level that needed more immediate attention. And I think the, the rest of the commission agreed. And so that was how Mr. Strout, who is independent of administration, um, was able to begin, which I think he formally began an investigation so that um, there is a an independent look at the things, and I think it's great that Mr. Kelly is um, is also been tasked by the mayor to start looking um, just harder and smarter at at the the problems that are so systemic. Um, and I, you know, for me, uh, it, is, it becomes painful to think of of good city employees who are either in fear of losing their job um, by doing what they believe is the right thing to do. Um, and I believe Lenny Corrigan is, is a good example of that. I have pretty much from the very beginning. Um, and, you know, I, 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 and there are other people right now today um, that either have been put on non-paid, unpaid leave um, and were offered a much, you know, a lesser job. Um, I don't necessarily, I mean, these are the things that we can't really get into. However, if it is in response or in retaliation to something that they have done, I think that that does um, warrant a comment and an input from the commission. Um, I don't think any of us would like to see another lawsuit come forward. And, and so we individually um, have to, we can't coordinate things outside of a public meeting. So sometimes there, some things might feel a little more convoluted than the public would like, but that's part of the process that we have set up to make sure that um, any conversations we're having, we're having with you present. Um, so I, I would say that um, I have a lot of faith in Mr. Strout. Um, he's got big shoulders and, and he takes this responsibility. Um, he, 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 um, he knows how important this is, I'll just say it that way. So, um, Mayor, I, I do, I feel very strongly that, um, that the signal has to get sent to everybody in administration that if Mr. Strout um, has come over to start looking at anything that, um, and I think Commissioner Materia said it, the chilling effect is, is just so counterproductive and this is an important function of city government um, and anything that we can do to make sure that it is respected, um, we need to do. I think, um, and, and, I, and I totally agree with you and I, I know and I understand Mr. Stroud's job is to seek out, find, right, where there's any waste, fraud, or abuse, mismanagement, misspending of money, that's what he needs to do. And he will be fully supported by my office to do that and by the people who work in this city. I think 
Um, this particular situation is still unclear to me. I met with Mr. Stroud today. Um, I, I, um, uh, he was not in a meeting. He was touring the plant. Um, so there's some misinformation out there. Um, the people who, with whom he was touring the plant were uh, contacted by the HR office, not by this commission, not by me, not by Mr. Mitchell, by the HR department. That's why we're doing an investigation of the HR department. Um, so we are um, you know, fully, uh, fully committed to, to making sure that we figure out what's going on there and making it right.